Acne is a problem that we see as dermatologists every day. And it's a problem that is growing as we see with patients that are getting it more and more in both adults as well as adolescent age groups. So the important thing that we see as dermatologists is that there is a change in what we are encouraging uh, people to come in for to be treated for acne. First of all, if you see acne that is out of control, in other words, if you see, for example, that your child has acne that is not being treated uh, easily with over-the-counter treatments such as benzoyl peroxide, then it's probably time for you to see a dermatologist. Additionally, there's another type of acne that we see that has very tiny little bumps on the forehead and it can also spread to the chest and back and that's more of a yeast related acne and none of the treatments that are over the counter will address that. Lastly, there's a type of acne that really isn't acne and that's actually a bacterial infection. So we see a lot of uh, children and uh, young adults that are in school or in the workforce who get uh, infected by a phone, a new uh, person who might have a staph infection in their environment, even just touching something as simple as an elevator in a hospital environment, and then they can get staph infection from it. So if you see acne that has rather large bumps or pustules that is all over your face and body, then that's actually a different sort of condition than what general acne is. Now. We see an awful lot of people who have tried everything over the counter and they don't go to a dermatologist to seek uh, treatment for their acne. That's a mistake. I think that it's important to see a dermatologist if you have acne that is not getting controlled within a short period of time, say two to four weeks with over-the-counter treatments, or if you have a concern that it is scarring. Because the scarring is something that can't be treated once it's done, but is very easily treated or prevented by adequate treatment from acne. So, if you do have a concern about acne and just have mild to moderate acne, one thing you can consider is the Lovely Skin Regimen. The Lovely Skin Regimen consists of a cleanser that is very nice. You use that twice a day. It's very concentrated. Only a dime size on your hand, suds it up and put it over your face and wash. Then after that, you can use a toner mist, which is just a vitamin C preparation from Dead Sea Mineral Salts. And that is used to either take care of any uh, irritation you might have or to set uh, makeup and then you would also use an acne care and an acne care has nine percent amino fruit acids and that you can put about a dime size in your palm rub your palms together put it on your face and you can uh, go on your way now if you have any need for moisturization there's a moisturizer as well that goes along with it now it's very important to remember that acne is many different things. Some of them require a visit to the dermatologist. Some can be treated over the counter uh, medications or treatments very easily, such as a lovely skin or benzoyl peroxide products. But it's important to remember, if it isn't going along according to plan, go to see your dermatologist. Thank you. Bye.